Welcome back everybody to the Curse of the Dead Gods. Hope you're doing well today. And in today's video, we're going to be moving on to the Path of Hubris. In the last one, we did the Path to Cruelty, where we defeated the Jaguar Avatar once again. And this time, we should be defeating the Eagle Avatar. As was the last one, all the damage is increased, enemies are just a little bit more deadly, traps are more deadly, etc, etc. So, it's just a little bit harder than it was before. But, with any luck, we should be able to do it. It only took us two attempts on the last one, so hopefully with this one, it won't take us any more than that either. Oh, okay. Off to a great start. How wonderful. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude. I've never tried because the, the circle circle is scary. Mmm, very good. Mistake. <laughs> mm. No. Da okay, we're doing the second attempt at the path of hubris. Oh. No. Okay, attempt number three. No. Okay, this is attempt number four. Um, I'm still gonna be dumb, and I'm gonna use this constitution stacking setup because now I'm being stubborn. And I refuse to change from doing that because I would be giving in. I'm giving in to the dungeon, and I'm not giving in. No, no. Uh... Pretty good fight. I had a couple bad things at the very end. Here we go. You can parry his charges, but that's not how you do it. Behind. 
it, alright? No. It's a new day. I'm kind of refreshed, sort of relaxed, and almost ready to take on the challenge again. Hopefully we'll be able to do it. Nice, calm go through. Victory awaits us at the end. I'm doing my favorite blessings, you know, Serpent's Bounty, the favor of Sakal, and Divine Perception. I'm just gonna stick to what I like, what I'm good at, keep it nice and simple, actually win. And much traps. Oh no. Wow. Oh. Hello. What's in here? Can you heal me? Nope. Bit of help. Wow! No! 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 I. We're back, and as you know, common saying, "15th time is the charm." I've got a full eagle build. I've got. I unlocked the blessing where I can get an additional agility point at the end of each chamber where I've done it perfectly. Take no damage, get an extra thing. Probably the wrong choice considering I'm dying a lot. But I'm gonna do it anyways. And then I also have perfect dodges give me haste as well as, you know, I start with five agility. And in addition, I've got the wind, like large stun area for the parries. Uh, kind of going with that is a lightning shield and throwing axes, I think. So let's go gold. Stats gold. Stats. Weapon stats. Lots of stats. So the key of this one, we're gonna go slow. Try and go slow, Alex. I gotta remember the purpose of this is to get perfect room for the agility point. That is how we're gonna scale up and that's how we're gonna win. I mean, it's not that I'm not a fan. It's not my favorite though. Just gonna spit out a thing. Get some distance. Okay. 
That corner is not super great, friends. Come way over here or something, maybe. Or over there. It's fine too, I guess. But yeah, that works out. safe. Playing it safe. Taking the picks where I can. Okay. Not the greatest. Oh. Okay. Okay. Let's get rid of that. The The extra distance was really nice, actually, but I don't know. My stamina and perception heal when they are killed by the environment. I'll keep that. And then this, yeah, you know, extra stamina is nice, too. So, three, six. Okay. Let's see, how much is that going to increase? So, 24, 13. We go attributes maybe, and then weapon upgrade. I'm playing the way I should be. I forgot I had the relic that heals me for environment kills. Oh, okay. Mm. Ah. Next. Next. No. Nope. Next. <laughs> okay. Could be that could be something. It's, it's, oh, I can't buy it though. Shit. Next. Parrying reflects projectiles. Main weapons affixes are doubled. Each attack consumes five gold. Let me see something. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Let's think about that for a moment. Okay. I've thought about it some. Going to do it. Let me look at the damage of the mace. Let's see what it looks like now. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because of the curse weapon. Yes. Oh, that's so good. Boom. Yes. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. Oh, it's so good. I didn't even think about it. Just like auto triggering the lightning strikes. Oh, dude. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's upgrade it. Oh, dude. Bad thing is, I've got a lot of curses going on right now. That's sort of a bummer. Um. I'm, I'm I'm in dangerous territory right here. <laughs> I'm in some pretty dangerous territory. Gonna charge in. Out of that, <clears throat> almost at it. Mm. There we go. I uh, took a bit of damage there. It's not the end of the world. I haven't really looked at my, yeah, oh yeah, perfect, fine. Keep that one. Kinda want that one gone. I might keep that. I'll probably get rid of you. Okay, here we go. Ooh. Nice, that would be really cool. He dropped his, I've never gotten his weapon before. So my corruption's gonna go all the way down and I'm gonna get rid of a curse. That's really cool. Simple attack and offhand combo deliver massive damage at the cost of one stamina point. Oh god. I... Wow. Okay. It's tempting. Because, um... I have a bunch of curses. But also... Hmm. Now, uh, I'm gonna use it to get rid of a curse. We're, we're just, we're gonna play it safe. Play it safe. We'll take, get rid of this one. Keep that. And off you go. So I'm back to zero. I've got two spots where I can take curses. Hopefully it won't come to that. Well on our way though. We are well on our way. Okay. We could do gold event. Maybe event stats. Bold, bold choices. I've been trying to go flawless anyway, so in theory, I will succeed. No! Oh, oh my god, what the? F oh, come on, dude. Where? Mm, 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 mm. Wow. Simply wow. What? What the? F okay. I'm back. I'm picking up my daughter, exercising, a bit of playing, and now, better mood. And this is it. This is, this is where we went. I know I've said it maybe a half dozen times now, but this real. For real, this is the time. This is the one. We stick to the same thing as this guy. Calm and cool, take the shots where you can. Mind your distance because if he starts doing stuff. All right, here it goes, I'm gonna do the same. This is the one where you need to kind of like watch it. If you get caught in that, it's gonna do so much damage. Oops. 
poison and fire is just gonna chunk away at him, which is great. Damn it! Put it. See. took one hit in there. A little unfortunate and it was a big one, but that's okay. We're okay. Should be able to do it. Should be. We're gonna dodge him. We're gonna get behind him. Triple hits. There we go. Luckily that can punish me. Spin. There we go. Right now, it's never, ooh, that's fine. Close. There we go. After another break, I did some side events. I got more crystal skulls. I unlocked a couple new blessings. So uh, I'm using Tamok's Breath. So there's a chance for my non-elemental, ooh, physical attacks, non-elementary, to do physical burning fire attacks. And then my fire is going to illuminate further. And I also got the, and I take less damage while in the light. And I've got the swapping blessing. So if I kill somebody with two primaries, my two-handed weapons will do more. If I do it the other way, then the other ones do more. So yeah, we'll see. So this should do more chance for fire, poison. I was kind of hoping to also get, I missed the only physical portion of that blessing, but you know, I think it'll be okay.
Here we go. So that passive isn't going to do much for me here, but... Ooh, the throwing stars can be pretty solid here. Like, if I actually do the timing correctly, then I get perfect dodges. Like that. I need more damage. Bummer. So much less damage than when I do the, like, trial move. Or no, it was just less. Oh, the, I take less damage in the light, so it's working out nicely. Okay. Kill. Took one hit there, but I didn't take that much damage, which is great. Forward. Why? No, what? It only took us two attempts on the last one, so hopefully, if this one, it won't take us any more than that. 